Hi, I'm Michelle Sterling for Friends of Science Society. Last night here in Edmonton, we removed part of the uncertainty on climate change. We, in fact, enhanced the uncertainty on climate change because we hosted Marine Pools and a screening of his film, The Uncertainty Has Settled. We had about um, probably 150 people, 100 people in the theater, and they were all quite receptive to the message that actually Rachel Notley said some time ago. She said, I think that the important thing to do is to have open dialogue and debate, rational, respectful, thoughtful, debate and dialogue and put the facts in front of the anger. So for many months now we've been told in Alberta that climate change denial is not an option and I don't know anyone who actually denies that climate changes. I think that this effort to silence people and intimidate people is wrong in a democracy. I think that we should ask the Premier to go along with her own statement that respectful, thoughtful, open debate are very important and that we should put the facts in front of the anger. So we're very pleased that people came out to the screening of Marine's award-winning film. We hope that other people will look at it. It's online on Vimeo. You can rent it for a nominal fee. Um, it is best to see it on the big screen if you can. So Chromecast it at home to your large screen TV because the photography is stunning. Now in terms of Alberta, this is the breadbasket of Canada, Alberta, Saskatchewan, Manitoba. And we are being told recently by the Prairie Climate Centre, which is supposed to be a climate science research institute, that first of all they're trying to scare farmers into thinking, oh my god, we're going to have more droughts and floods and catastrophes. And all those things may happen, because that's weather and that's climate, and that's not something we can control. But then they're telling people, you know what, we'll take you from risk to resiliency, Put up a wind farm, put up solar panels on your farm. If you watch Marine Pool's film, you will understand that that is destructive to the economy, it's destructive to our food security, it will not give us energy security, and it's the last thing that we need in Canada. This is a very cold country. We have extreme weather conditions in winter. Wind and solar are not effective for this place, and they are destructive to the agricultural communities of the world. So I ask people to please look at his film. Uh, please have a look at his presentation, which will be online shortly on our Friends of Science YouTube site. And please ask Premier Rachel Notley to stand by her words that we need to have open, rational, thoughtful debate and dialogue on this important issue. For Friends of Science Society in Edmonton, right near the legislature, I'm Michelle Sterling.